Are you ready to stop managing all your leads manually? Or if you've ever asked yourself, can I automate my sales funnel? The answer is yes. In this video, I will show you a bunch of automated workflows you can build without coding that will put your lead management workflows on autopilot. So if you're part of a marketing or sales team tired of manual follow-ups or a freelancer or an agency ready to streamline your lead management, this video is for you. I hope all the workflow ideas will give you a lot of inspiration, a lot of ideas, and show you how easy it is without any technical expertise to build these workflow automations so you or your team can start spending more time on the strategy work and not the manual work that eats up all your hours. Let's say you're a business and you're running ads on LinkedIn and that's where you're getting all your leads. So what are the first couple of steps you're probably doing? The first step might just be like adding all those leads to a spreadsheet. Or maybe you're just alerting a team member on a Slack or a Teams message that, hey, you know, we have this new lead that came in that needs to be followed up on. So let's look at a couple of these pre built Zapier template that can help us automate that work. So here we have a pre built workflow automation template that sends a private Slack channel message for any new LinkedIn ads lead that is generated from a form response. Basically, all all we're doing is connecting our LinkedIn ads to our Slack so as soon as a new lead fills out a form on LinkedIn we can send that message to the Slack team. The same way we have another template here which will send a Teams message when someone registers for an event through LinkedIn ads. So the idea so the premise is basically the same we have an action that is happening on LinkedIn anytime somebody fills a form or like they engage with the ad and we have their information and we're sending that information to our Teams communication channel be it Slack or Microsoft Teams. So that's a simple workflow so the team can stay on top of things. Maybe you have too many leads coming in maybe you don't want Slack messages all the time and you just want to add everything to your CRM. Traditionally what you or your team might be doing is looking at all the data and copying it back to your CRM or spreadsheet manually. But what if you just connect your LinkedIn ads to your CRM so they can talk to each other without you manually copy pasting data. And that's exactly what's going on for all these workflow templates for CRM automation. So regardless of uh, what your CRM tool is, Pipedrive, HubSpot or something else, we can again use a drag and drop editor to connect our LinkedIn ads to our CRM, pick the right action, for example, creating a contact. And now every time we have a lead through our ad, it's being automatically added to our CRM. So no more manual work. And if you already have email sequences in your CRM, that every time there's a new contact or lead added, you run them through a nurturing sequence, boom. It goes from a LinkedIn ad to your CRM and your email nurturing sequences all automatically. And what about a scenario where you don't have enough information about the lead to send that personalized outreach message? We need to enrich the lead. So typically what we would do, we would have the lead come in, then have somebody go use certain tools or do the research manually, and then enrich all the data about the lead we need to know. But what if we just add that to our automation step as well? Oh my God! Here we have a template that can enrich our leads using Clearbed. I hope you can start seeing like how Zapier automations can start putting all these apps together. Here we have a LinkedIn ad. Now we just send that data to Clearbed. We're just gonna find the person, gather more information about the person, and then create that contact again in a CRM. And now instead of just submitting their name and their email, we're gonna take information from Clearbed and add all that to our contact as well. That way our CRM has a lot more complete information about the lead. Or it's 2025, we gotta be using AI. So what would the workflow look like if we start incorporating a little bit of AI into our automations? So with this automation template, as soon as we get the new response through our LinkedIn ad, we ask AI to craft an email for them. Based on the information we gather from the form submission, we pass all the information to either ChatGPT or, or Claude Benthropic. It's going to take the information based on a prompt, craft the personalized outreach email, and now we can connect our Gmail or Outlook and send the personalized email right away. So depending on the workflow, if we have to reach out to the person right away after they fill out the lead gen form on LinkedIn, we can have ChatGPT work through the data, create the email, and we have Gmail connected within the Zapier workflow, they can automatically either create the draft or send the email right away. So with all these automations, what we're really doing is using Zapier as a platform. We're connecting all these different applications you use at work together and giving it instructions on what to do. Essentially everything we would do manually, we're just putting it through this automated workflow so we can save all that time. And we'll build these automations once, start with the templates, connect our accounts, configure the settings, and these workflows will run automatically all the time. So if you're a RevOps pro or just getting started with workflow automation, I hope you feel inspired and empowered on how you can start automating a lot of your lead gen workflows. And of course, it's not limited to LinkedIn ads. Maybe it's a form on your website. Maybe it's a Google Ads campaign that you're running. All these workflows work with all different campaigns you may want to run. So for more inspiration and ideas and step-by-step -step tutorial, subscribe to the Zapier channel for more videos on AI and workflow automations for your business. We'll see you next time.